whether it's candies or chocolate or even the odd slice of cake. Sugar is a temptation to which many people just can't say no, even if they want to do. Sugar addiction is a real phenomenon and there are different levels. There are those people who are profoundly addicted as if they were alcoholic, but the majority of people do have a mild addiction and it's very difficult to stop it and it takes willpower and the fact is it's addictive in the sense that if you take one speed teaspoon of sugar back again in your tea, that's it. You will go straight back to where you were. So how serious is it and how worried should sweet eaters be? If PET scans of the brain have shown that for a cocaine addict, certain centers light up. For a person who's a sugar addict and who consumes sugar, the exact same centers li uh, light up for that person. So sugar is definitely an addiction. More and more people are checking into this clinic every week. Sugar may indeed be the sweetest thing, but there can be a bitter price to pay. 22-year-old Tanya Bosman almost paid with her life. I was actually at a friend's house and I was standing over the kitchen counter and I was just consuming food at an enormous rate, sort of, you know, you know it's wrong. You shouldn't be consuming food at this level. And that's the reason why the next day I actually went onto the web and I Googled and I realized I had a food problem, but I didn't realize that my problem was actually, you could pinpoint it down to sugar and carbohydrates addiction. The experts say they're not against sugar, merely that as with all things, take it in moderation. However tempted you may be to keep coming back for more. Travis Andrews, CCTV, Cape Town.